so in the last class we have completed the reading portion up to goa so today we will start from kerala right i can see so many hands are raised here but at the end of the class at the end of the class i will talk to you okay ashia you start reading this part kerala kerala lies in the extreme south of the western coastal plain plains sorry from this part you unmute yes, your device yes kerala lies in the extreme south of the west coastal plains tiruvananthapuram is the capital of the state the main occupation of the people is of the state is agriculture rice is the main crop cultivated in the state the other crops include tea rubber coffee cardamom chestnut banana coconut and sugar cane kerala is famous for coconut and sugar cane kerala is famous for traditional industries right yes ma'am some of the items furniture are puri are the and and loose and and malayalam and english are the main languages spoken here anamudi in kerala is the highest peak in the western ghat okay 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 that's it okay very good so now students you can see here that kerala lies in the extreme south of the western coastal plains so to the extreme south there lies kerala and what is the capital of this state that is tiruvanthapuram okay tiruvanthapuram is the capital what is the main occupation of the people living here the people of the state the main occupation of the people of the state is agriculture that means they grow crops the main crop is rice that is cultivated here and what are the other crops they are tea rubber coffee cardamom cashew nuts banana and coconut sugar cane these are also some other crops that are grown here kerala is very famous for the traditional industries some of the items manufactured here are coir hand loom coir means what coir means the outer that rough fibery skin a fibrous skin sorry of coconut you all know that we make ropes with that coir c o i r coir that outer skin that is very fibrous that uh, of coconut that is called coir and hand looms and handicrafts kerala is the most literate state of india malayalam and english are the main languages that are spoken here and what is the highest peak in western ghats that is situated in kerala that is anamudi kerala is very famous for its temples like the guruvayur temple and uh, shavari mala temple these are some very famous temples of kerala kathakali and mohiniattam these are the two famous dance forms classical dance forms of kerala onam is the popular festival that is celebrated here and snake boat races are held during the onam festival so you were asking me in the last class that what is this this picture is of onam festival festival here snake boats you can see these boats are the front part of these boats are uh, like the snakes okay so these are called the snake boats and snake boat races so many people are participate in this race they race uh, on the water that uh, they, and that is done during the onam festival now the next one the next state is odisha okay shushnata you unmute your device yes ashia yes, you are raised just a second shushnata ashia you are, why you are just waving your hand no ma'am yes i am late for you uh bring it a little bit close to the camera 
ओके वेरी नाइस दैट इज अ वेरी नाइस गिफ्ट very nice and you have made it very nicely also very good ashia and that is very very nice and beautiful very good thank you so much next shushnata you read this part odisha and ma'am happy teachers day in happy teachers day to you thank you so much thank you for wishing me thank you so now you read this part yes ma'am i am reading Odisha Odisha is located on the east of India by bay of the by the bay of Bengal Bhubaneswar is the capital of Odisha Chilka Lake is in this region Odisha is the home to many tribes that have their own style for clothes Mahanadi is the major river that flows through this state Hiraput dam is built across the river Mahanadi The coastal region of this state is hit by major cyclones almost every year The the state is famous for temples such as Lingaraja temple at Bhubaneswar Jagannath temple at Jagannath temple at Puri and Yes. Jagannath Temple and at Puri and at Puri and Sun Temple at Konark. The Ratha Yatra of Odisha is a special festival associated with Lord Jagannath in Puri. Yes. Okay. 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 So here we can see that Odisha is located on the east. Odisha is located on the east coast of India by the Bay of Bengal and Bhubaneswar is the capital of Odisha and Chilka Lake is in this region so Chilka Lake is a very famous place for the visitors that is also present in this region Odisha is the home to many tribes that they have their own style for clothes so tribes means tribal yeah. people means who yes yes Krishnata ma'am yeah. can i stay unmuted because i will not make any noise okay if you promise that you will not make you will stay uh, keep the silence you can keep unmuted no problem there so mahanadi is the major river that flows through this strait so through this in odisha we can see mahanadi there and hirakud dam is also present there that is built on the river mahanadi this coastal region of the state hits the major cyclones almost every year every year so whatever the major cyclones generally come towards india come to the eastern part of india that falls or that lands uh, through uh, on the uh, odisha first then they come to other states the state is very famous for temples such as the lingaraj temple at bhubaneswar jagannath temple at puri and sun temple at konark the rath yatra of odisha you all know that is very very famous festival of jagar lord jagannath in puri next one is puducherry oshmit bosh oshmit you unmute your device yes ma'am and read this part puducherry the union territory of puducherry earlier known as pondicherry lies to the south of chennai the people here speaks french and tamil the main occupation of the people is farming farmers mainly grow rice all oil seeds sugar cane and coconut puducherry is famous for sri arobindo ashram ashram Ma Masquerade, masquerade or mask festival masquerade, masquerade or mask festival is an important festival, festival of puducherry so the union territory of puducherry which was earlier known that before it was known as pondicherry now it is known as puducherry it lies to the southern part of chennai the people here they speak french and tamil these are the two languages that are spoken by the people here the main occupation of the people here is farming they are the they also grow the crops and farmers mainly grow rice oil seeds 
oil seeds means mustard oil or sunflower oil that we get the oils that we get they grow these uh, seeds and uh, sugar cane and coconut puducherry is very famous for sri aurobindo ashram you know this one the picture you can see here in your book that is the picture of sri aurobindo ashram and masquerade or mask festival is very fa famous festival of puducherry now we will learn about the people of the islands so the union territory of andaman and nicobar islands comprises of two island groups the andaman andaman islands and the nicobar islands the islands of lakshadweep and andaman and nicobar are mostly inhabited by the tribals tribals means i have told you before the people who uh, are generally uh, who are the, the that area is not that much developed those people they prefer to uh, speak in their own local language and uh, they generally do uh, they uh, Uh, they are with their own culture they like their own culture their own traditions their own festivals their own clothes that means everything is local and completely their own so these people are called tribal uh, tribals or tribes they live in their old and traditional way so though the world is now so much developed but they like to live in the traditional and older ways fishing is the main occupation and coconut in, is their main crop so as this is the coastal area that we are talking about so coconut is or their main crop paddy or rice is the main food crop and is mostly cultivated in the andaman groups of islands different kinds of fruits are can also be grown there are also grown there that are mango sapota and uh, orange banana papaya pineapples and some root crops are also grown here and uh, the nikobori dance is one of the most important and oldest traditional dances of andaman and nikobar island so this is nikobori dance is the dance form that is one of the oldest dance dance forms of this region some of the famous dances of lakshadweep islands include kolkali and uh, parichakli and lava these are the names of some dance forms okay these are the names of some dance forms of lakshadweep so here this chapter ends so let's have a quick review what we have read in what we have read in this chapter so open the first page this chapter is about the coastal plains and the islands we have learned about what is a coast which region will be called a coast and the eastern coastal plains and about the western coastal plains and eastern coastal plains of india we have Apparently, learned about some places of the eastern coastal plains and the places of the islands what are the two main island groups andaman and nicobar islands and the lakshadweep islands so we have learned about those area the coastal areas like gujarat goa kerala and puducherry and at last we have also learned about the people who live in the islands okay now let's start doing this mcq question answers and i have already done it you have already done it okay the answer the first answer will be a coast okay let's see yes that is the correct answer now the next question is kochi is the most important dash on the malabar coast island market port or school port answer will be port yes that is the correct answer okay now the next question question number 3 the andaman and nicobar islands is located in the dash ocean indian Which ocean indian ocean indian ocean okay let's see yes very good that is the correct answer next the people of gujarat are called dash gujaratis the people of gujarat are called gujaratis
Okay, I can see some students uh, have raised their hands. I'm unmuting you. If you can uh, tell the answers, you can tell it, but you should not shout. Okay, don't shout. If you know the answer, just tell the answer. Okay. Farzana, Shirin, I can see. Sahi, my Ma video. Yes, my video is on. You can see me. No, I can't see you. I can't see you. Oh. I can't Okay, don't look at the standout for video on laptop. Yes, yes. The video is on from one device. Okay, let me tell you one thing. Students, you should not shout. Okay, you if you know the answer, you tell the answer. If anybody shouts, then I'll have to mute them again. So let's see what is the question. What is the answer of this question? The question number five. Fishing and farming are the main occupations followed by the people of Dash. Goa. Followed by the people of Goa. Very good. That is the correct Man, answer. You can unmute me. I don't make any sound. Yes, you are unmuted, Farzana. You are not muted. I can hear you. Next question number six. Anamodi in Dash is the highest peak in the Western Ghats. Kerala. Kerala. So, Anamodi is present in Kerala. So, let's see. That is the correct answer or not. Yes, that is the correct answer. Very good, students. So, I am again showing you all the answers so that the students were still writing. They can write the answers. The students who are still writing, you write down the answers. The first answer, the first the answer of the first question, it will be a coast. A coast is a land beside or near to a sea or an ocean. Next, answer of question number two will be a port. P-O-R-T, port. Mark it in your book. Third answer will be Indian Ocean. The fourth answer will be Gujaratis. The fifth answer will be Goa. And the sixth answer will be Kerala. Okay. So that's it. Now let's see the next part. Hello, ma'am. Yes, Sahi. I am. Ma'am, I am a doubt. Ma'am, what you project? Have a doubt. You have a doubt. Ma'am, okay. what project? You, you are hearing. I am in later project. Can I show what is the project? project? Okay, I have given you one project on water pollution. Water pollution. The causes, effects, causes of water pollution, effects of water pollution and how we can stop water pollution. But I have not given any time to submit it right now. I told you to prepare it. Okay. I will give you the time. Submission. Water pollution. Okay, Sahim? One time, so. I will show you. You will have to make it. I have given you the clues how to write it. I have explained it in one class. Okay, if you want, I can, uh, I can give you some some uh, examples or some sample papers I can send you in the study material. Okay? I will send you the study material. Okay, now the next part you can see here, students, that is match the following. Match the following. Okay? Tilka Lake. Tell me what will it be? Then Odisha. Then Odisha. Then Odisha. Then Odisha. Lagoons. Then shallow salt water. Shallow salt water. Shallow salt water. Vishakhapattanam. Port. Then port. Then port. Panaji. Capital of Goa. Capital of Goa. Capital of Goa. Gandhi Nagar. Capital of Goa. Capital of Goa. Capital of Goa. And Lakshadip. The smallest union territory. Union territory. So you have told me the answers. Let's see whether the answers are correct or any wrong answer is there. Let's check it. All the answers are correct. Very good, students. Very good. So I'm again showing you the answers so that you can write it down. The students who are writing it, right? Chilka Lake, it will be Orisa. Lagoons, it will be shallow saltwater lakes. Visha will be Pope. Panaji, it will be capital of Goa. 
Gandhinagar it will be capital of Gujarat and Lakshadweep will be the smallest union. Okay. Ma'am, I am Swarnaksh. I want to show you something. Yes, Swarnaksh. Ma'am, I am looking for you. You have made this. Okay, that is very beautiful. Hello, ma'am. I am sitting on the lily. I am nice also. Very nice. Very oh, nice I'm and very beautiful. Very nice. Yeah. Very good, Swarnaksh. Ma'am, today yeah, you also answered the following question. Yes, ma'am. 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 Yes,
then just uh, leave one uh, line or change the paragraph and then write the next part of the question okay so here the next answer will be the two main groups of islands of india are andaman and nicobar islands and lakshadweep islands so this much you will have to write now tell me the question number 4 राइट Okay. Is this question hottest or not on the Andaman and Nicobar Islands? Can you tell us about that attracts tourists? So the names of the major beaches of Goa that attracts tourists are are the names that are given here. Though you can see some red Kalam lines Lut, after that, but Anjuna just yes, Kalam Butte and Anjuna and Vegetar. These are the names of the beaches. that attracts the tourists in goa and next is right something right on the andaman no no you don't need to write it now in india we have already learned it yes that and the andaman and nicobar islands is one of the most uh, one of the seven union territories of india that is located in the eastern part of india that is called andaman and nicobar islands and nicobar islands are the seven of india that is located in the indian ocean and what is the capital of andaman and nicobar that is cool i have to write in the code player yes this full part you will have to write because the question is write a short note on andaman and nicobar islands and this question may contain even three marks okay so you will have to write this much the and territory comprises yes yes she did you will do that google map activity in the first of the chapter No, 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 no. The activity portions, none of the activity portions that are given in your book, you will have to do. Okay, just skip that. For this exam, it will not come. The territory comprises five hundred and seventy-two tropical islands. And what is the main occupation of the people who live here? That is agriculture. Paddy or rice. That is the main crop. Okay, okay. Uh, you can take a screenshot. I will also send it in the study material so that you don't get any problem. Coconut, spices, rubber. These are also grown here. Indira Point on the Nicobar Islands is the southernmost point of India. So these are the most important lines. But there are many drawing in SST. No, no, no. In SST, no drawing will come. The chapters that you have in this SA one exam. No drawings will come from this chapter. Okay. Ma'am, so today I can so see the class doubt. time is already over. Ma'am. Yes, you can tell me what doubt you have. You can tell me now. Just a second. Ma'am, 